We've used the electronic medical record for the past three years um, and um, the nurses were really um, involved in implementing their documentation. It's all evidence-based using the PEP and we actually um, uh, presented, I, I presented at ONS when we developed the documentation, so it's all, all evidence-based documentation, um, but it was different from the paper form going into the electronic medical record. And just to meet Joint Commission standards, best practices, there's a lot of documentation that goes on. Um, I, I think that the nurses, um, it just had, they needed time to get used to um, documenting in the electronic medical record. There were ma many revisions. They were really the core group that um, developed or um, changed the document to really best fit their needs and how they practice each day. That way it's part of their practice. Um, in terms of the patient portal, we had a team, um, not just nursing, but throughout um, different um, departments to get that um, up and running. Um, that's something that we actually are still currently um, trying to streamline different processes and how we could have patients um, on the patient portal. We do have a percentage of our patients already on the portal, which is fantastic. And uh, we're looking now at having um, some survivorship information in there and how can survivors also um, benefit from the patient portal.